Trail Tech and Let's Public Land Riders. Let's go shred some tires. All right, hey guys, what is up? Welcome to the channel for today's video. We uh, got into some snow. Oh boy, you got trees down already. And we are in for quite an interesting ride. Okay, and it looks like we're right into it. So far, it's just me and Jared out here. Oh, okay. Okay, trees down in the f trail already, mint. So this is how it's gonna be today. So yeah, we'll see uh, how <laughs> the trails are actually in. Yeah, we'll see how many more of those there are. Yeah. Oh, all right, excellent. Well, that's one way to warm up and get into the trail. Awesome, loving that. Oh uh, yeah. I'm really impressed with this tire right here right now. I've equipped this bike with one of the Dunlop AT81 EXs just like we had on the KLX 140 and it's awesome. I usually end up going that way. I think I do the same thing every time. Okay. All right, let's pull a U-turn here on the side of the hill. This section of trails over here on this side of the mountain face were all brand new to me so it was like a lot of fun that just every inch of the trail is like new and you don't really know what's coming up but it was kind of weird after running the, str the street tire for so long and then coming over to the sticky tire like it doesn't slip the same way on the hill climb so that was a bit different of having to like slip the clutch more instead of having the tire slip more because it like want to cut rpm now we're trains after getting to play train conductor for a little bit, we went and met up with our new buddy, Jaden, that we had just met here for the first time. This is the first time we went out riding with him. Now this side of the mountain was a little patchy between having nice sunny spots that are dry and beautiful to ride on, and then you come around the corner and then there's snow and ice covering the rocks and it's slippery as all hell. So first off here, we're ripping on this trail. I think it was called the Kawasaki Trail, and you see, because there's a little cow, there's a Kawasaki hanging in the trees. contemplating taking that K2 trail just past us on the right there we were just looking at but with the conditions of just the ice and the amount of rock slabs that were on that trail we decided to pass on it for now. So yeah brand new trails all day. And you know that brand new trails are one of my favorite things of all time so I'm super stoked to be out here and super thankful that they invited me to come out riding with them for the day today. What the I see why it's Kawasaki Trail. Huh. Old KDX. Okay, chill, Aaron. Just trying to keep myself calm, keep the heart rate down, and uh, stop my hands from cramping up because it's been a while since I've been out riding. It looks like we're out every single weekend, but uh, I've been taking a bit of a break and we've been out just making our own trails, which is not including a lot of riding recently, so it's a bit of a workout for me on this one. at this point and I'm starting to get caught off guard by like the hill like I think you're at the top and it just gets steeper and goes further so it's just got to commit harder <laughs> holy crap hey you don't want to stop on that hill too that Jared ahead of me. He, he's been in here and he's the one leading us so he's got an idea of what's coming ahead. I'm just blindly falling behind him. It's a great time though. Mm -hmm. 
What the hell are you doing? It's greasy over here. Making a shortcut? It looked like somebody went up here, so I tried it. It didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, I see now. Soft ground. While Jared goes to the bottom, I'm gonna give it a shot right now. And unfortunately, I just don't quite get over that one little pesky root. There's no way. Oh yeah, nice one! Yeah, just enough momentum, just enough snap to throttle that it's able to get up and over that stupid root. on the hillside. After second failed attempt, we're gonna try and go around this tree here on my left. We'll try and pivot it around. This ground really is just so soft. Ah, uh, right in the hole. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. As you can see, the dirt's literally just starting to crumble away beneath the bike, trying to go down the hill. Okay. Oh, I'm cramping up. Dumb. <laughs> that was a perfect start until you hit out that little loose spot and then the traction will be all gone. fixed that bark buster and we're back in action. Let's get up this goddamn hill, man. All right, well, after I don't know how long that was, but a bit of a struggle bus there. Yeah. 
Yeah, this stuff's a lot of jarring stuff, that's for sure. And a couple pieces of hidden snow here and there. But at least we're out with a good group of boys here. This stuff's always just pure freaking our town. There's a lot of just big, chunky, gnarly, juicy stuff out in these trails here. It's just big, chunky rock, big honking roots just sticking out everywhere. Everything's trying to trip you up everywhere you go throughout these trails. It's a lot of fun though, challenging, good times. And it helps that once again, these guys have been here before. At least we know Jared has 100% because he's leading the way. But Jaden said this place was his stomping ground, so. Good times. Actually a little bit snowier today. Now we're gonna start climbing in elevation and we're gonna get into a bit more of that slippery white powdery stuff. It's gonna be fun, but uh, definitely hard with this crappy front tire on the bike to keep the bike upright and keep it pointed where you want it to actually freaking go. But it was nice to get a bit of a breather here. Yeah, we're in a brand new riding area not from here and uh, never been over on this side of the mountain here it's pretty cool just enough snow to be cool and snowy but not too much that it's inridable or impassable but there's a lot of new tree fall is what uh, Jared's saying which is fair because we've come a lot, across a lot of trees down today slippery let's burn through this brand new tire <laughs> <laughs>
playing in the snow today. Okay, well, it's uh, icy and snowy. Really wasn't expecting this, considering how beautiful and nice it is at our house. And up here, it's just ah, icy and frosty. to a bit more of an actual pure techie trail here with just big rock ledges and walls and things to hop up. So it'll be a bit of an added challenge today. snow over everything really start to make things sketchy. Oh, there's a the rock there. Like your pipe? Yeah, the pipe. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you smashed that one too? <laughs> Thank God for this tire. super annoying right here because you have this log you're trying to climb up in the back but the front's just got this tiny ledge to try and climb up and it can't Son of a just can't get up that thing at the same time climbing front and rear there we go okay. Oh, I'm fucking toasty now. <laughs> well, that's not good. You good?
we go for the snowy enduro with the boys. <laughs> yeah, she's slimy, boys. So glad I came here with my new tire though. This would have been abysmal in the snow with the street tire, that's for sure. Oh, crushed my foot. Nice little satellite building. Neato. Holy Holy sh Down we go. Up we go. Oh my God. Big, big, big roller. That's all you gotta do is just roll it. Ah, doing a little bit of toboggan it. Ah, oh, there's hidden logs. Hidden logs, hidden rocks, hidden everything. It's a big log. Woohoo! Haha! <laughs> makes uh, a trail that would be just flat difficult. <laughs> See? Whoa! Nah! Nah! Whoo! Start going, and you're like, oh, I can recover. No, I can't recover. <laughs> Going, 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 gone. Yeah, like I was saying, flat stuff can become difficult. Damn it. All right, we're good. Well, now my one hand's pretty cold after putting it in the snow. Yeah, once you start falling, you just can't, it's pretty hard to recover. Now we're gonna get another chunky trail. Oh, that was a hard hit on that tree. Thankfully, we had our bark busters to save our hands there.
You good? I do not want to go this way. No. Nice. Yeah. Can you go around the outside of the tree? I wish I was just really good at riding. But hey, this is the only way to get good, right? So just keep sucking and eventually you won't suck anymore. was a solid day of ripping with the boys. Thanks for inviting me out, bud. That was a good time. It was nice meeting you. Jaden. Yes. Aaron. That's right. I don't have a good one, buddy. See you later, Jared.